You always hear this and people are like, well, that's just because it's the era you grew up in. That's why you think it's the best. But I kid you not, I grew up in like the best era of superhero cartoons. Like, they did have some other bangers down the road, like uh, Young Justice was pretty darn good, for instance, and that was like outside of my childhood. Young Justice when I came out when I was like 17 or something. But like, when I was like six to 12, we had like Batman the Animated Series, Justice League, Justice League Unlimited, we had uh, Teen Titans, we had Static Shock, we had Batman Beyond, like I, I was there at the best time for especially DC stuff. We had X-Men Evolution, which isn't DC, that's Marvel, but still just, it, it was the era of superhero cartoons for me. Just phenomenal. By the way, Ultitic has a horrible time trying to kill this thing. Hydro Pump? I would rather keep Surf. <laughs> I, uh, getting too many moves that can miss. Bum, 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 bum. I did not, I, I don't think I watched Spectacular Spider-Man. I'm pretty sure the only Spider-Man cartoon I watched was uh, two of them actually. I watched the original animated series, uh, you know, the one that everyone knows. And then I watched the, um, what the heck is it? I watched Spider-Man and His Amazing Friends, where it was like him, Iceman, and Firestar, like living in an apartment together or whatever. That was always really funny to me. I don't think that that uh, show was like very good, but I found it hilarious. Can you stop using Take Dam? All right, because of how bulky this thing is, well, the thing is, is that it's Blissey's Spadef that's making it bulky. So even if I'm like, let's go check the other Blissey trainer to see if Altitik can take it on better, like Altitik and Lotvar are gonna have trouble killing Blissey's no matter what. Uh, Gargoyles, really good cartoon. Not a superhero cartoon, but a really good cartoon. But man, like the animated DC universe of like Batman the Animated Series. There was also Superman the Animated Series, which I actually, um, I think I caught some episodes of it, but I never watched it as much as like Batman Animated Series or all the others. But like Batman Animated Series, Superman Animated Series, then like Static Shock, Teen Titans, uh, Batman Beyond, Justice League, Justice League Unlimited. Really, Justice League and Justice League Unlimited is like, it's one of the best cartoons ever made for me. One of the best cartoons ever made. They did so incredibly well with Justice League and Unlimited. Superman animated series has like four to five seasons. I need to go back and watch it sometime. I definitely remember catching a couple of episodes like here and there, but like I, I'm pretty sure I watched most of Batman the animated series. And I watched like all of Batman Beyond, Justice League, Static Shock, Justice League Unlimited. I watched like all of those multiple times. I'm sure I'd like Superman the Animated Series. I see you have a ride for talk about superior cartoons. Shroom, I name dropped uh, X-Men Evolution earlier. I know you're a fellow X-Men Evolution enjoyer, as you should be. You've never seen Static Shock? You should watch Static Shock. It holds up to this day, I promise you. Static Shock is incredible. Phenomenal cartoon. Same thing for X-Men Evolution. Like, all of those cartoons hold up. Like, I'm not, I, there are some shows that I watched when I was younger and I'm like, they're not actually good. I just like them for nostalgia, like Spider-Man and his amazing friends or whatever. But I, I kid you not, like, those cartoons, they hold up. They're just as good now as they were back then. 
and they were phenomenal. Can I get a burn? Stop minimizing. Please stop being insufferable. Oh my goodness. Really wish I would have hit the flamethrower instead, but here we are. I just need Altitic to get this one kill. And then it'll be high enough level. For my tastes. Here, have a refreshing... Refreshing? <laughs> refreshing lemonade. Here, get your flesh back with this lemonade. You would crit. We're gonna need to start buying hyper potions. Pokemon are getting uh, a lot of HP. Too much for lemonade to reasonably heal. I did not watch Avengers Earth's Mightiest Adventures. I'm telling you, I'm not uh, not much of a a Marvel person. I watched the MCU, like I watched all the movies up through Endgame and then a couple past Endgame. And now I don't watch Marvel movies either. I do not think Marvel is bad by any means. Marvel has got some good stuff for sure. But I'm just way more interested in, in uh, the DC heroes than I am the Marvel ones. <coughs> oh my goodness. I'm so tired of being sick, bro. Make sure I give you back these leftovers. There you go. I'm a fan of DC and Marvel. I mean, I'd, I'd probably say I'm a fan of both because I do like them both. I'm just way more a fan of DC. Like, DC is what I grew up on. DC are the characters that I was more interested in, etc., etc. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, Abra, take me down to Fuchsia. Take a drink of water before my throat explodes. Now I'm pretty sure, I don't remember which trainer it was. I wanna say it was this one that had a blissey. I'd ask you to join our biker gang, but you don't look the part. You wanna have another battle? Wait a minute, wait a minute. What Pokemon is up front? Hold up. All right, who have you got? Mimicargo. Okay, yeah, I remember this. You have to be weak to Water Pulse. Did I give Wapwar the lucky egg? I hope I did. Have you watched the original Ben 10? I watched every single episode of Ben 10 up until Omniverse, and then I watched like four episodes of Omniverse and hated it. <laughs> yeah, here we go. It's not a Blissey yet, it's a Chansey, but you have the, uh... You have the other Chansey fusion. And they are weak to water, which is great. Can they all stop having Minimize, though? OG Ben 10, Alien Force, and Ultimate Alien were all absolute banger shows. Omniverse Onward was bad. But man. Man, Ben 10, like... And I don't say this lightly, because there are so many incredible cartoons that exist. So I do not say this lightly. Ben 10, like, Ben 10 through Ultimate Alien. I would just say, like, Ben 10 Alien Force plus Ultimate Alien, because those were, like, direct... See, I mean... The original Ben 10, Alien Force was a direct sequel to it, but they did the time skip and all. But like, Alien Force to Ultimate Alien might be like the best cartoon ever made. Other than Avatar The Last Airbender, because Avatar The Last Airbender isn't fair. It's like, it, it, it's above everything. But man, man, Alien Force Ultimate Alien was so good. Did you watch any of the Sonic movies? No, I didn't. I actually want to watch the first two before the third one comes out. I'm not a huge Sonic guy, but like, I, I dabble. The franchise interests me. G 
you get Ice Beam, T-Bolt, and Flamethrower, and Trico? Yes. I also got Chikorita and Mudkip. Man, even at plus three, that is not a two at KO. Unless you hit yourself, you idiot! Moron! Buffoon! What a loser. Mimma Cargo! Imagine hitting yourself in confusion. Skill issue? That's what I've been saying, Shroom. I'm gonna set up two Calm Minds and then Draining Kiss. Perfect. What are we grinding for? I'm getting like all of the main Pokemon up to like level 48, like near 50. Because we've been running into high level 40 Pokemon. I feel like we're behind the eight ball. So I just want to catch up a little bit. And then while we're fighting those trainers with high level Pokemon on our way through like Silphco and all, we'll bring, our, bring along another Pokemon and experience share it for it to level up. Dead. Did you just... What happened? Did you see my Lotvar's HP go up? Did I just get HP EVs? Is that what just happened? Did I just get enough HP EVs to get another, like, bit of HP? <laughs> I hope this... I hope this dude's uh, Chansey evolves into a Blissey here in a second. Mostly because I want to see, like, Blissey Tyranitar. Because it's probably horrifying. Am I the only one that really doesn't like Legend of Korra? Legend of Korra is such, like, an up and down. It's such, like, a roller coaster, in my opinion. It has, uh... It's, it's third season is phenomenal. Incredibly good third season. First season is, like, pretty good. I think I like the first season more than the average person. Second season is hot trash, just truly terrible. And the third season is like, man, the more I look back on the fourth season, the more I actually just don't even think it was that good. I think it's like, okay, but it's not like great. I wouldn't even call it good really at this point. I'd just say it's like fine. Season three was amazing though. Season three of Korra was just wonderful. There are so many things that they just did poorly in Korra that I didn't like and etc cetera, etc. Cetera, unfortunately. Evolve, idiot! How about the Knuckles show? I literally have no idea what you're talking about. I don't know anything about any Knuckles show. If only Lopvor had Aura Sphere, now that would be sick. That would be pretty pog. I just saw this message higher up in chat. Chaos isn't about going fast, but you could say he has to move at a reasonable pace. Yeah, that sounds pretty accurate. I can only imagine how fast paced a show about Knuckles would be. He's the fastest character in fiction, man. The Flash wishes he had that speed. Anyway, there are things about Korra, uh, Legend of Korra I like, and there are things about Legend of Korra I really don't like. So, you know. It's like, the Legend of Korra is kind of like hit or miss, but I feel like it definitely misses more than it hits. But it has some pretty darn good hits, to be fair. AKA Season 3 and the entirety of Zaheer. We're not getting as much experience from this trainer because his Chansey isn't a Blissey yet. I need it to become a Blissey. Then we'll start getting more experience from it. Why do you think the Flash's suit is red? It's based off of Knuckles? Exactly. Holy cow, that's a radioactive hot 
taken, chat. Season 2 of Korra better than book 1 of Last Airbender? I, you're wrong. You're welcome to your opinion, but man, you're wrong. I think the old... <laughs> Sorry, I'm dying. I think the only season of Korra that is better than book one, or aka season one, of Last Airbender is season three. I think season three of Korra is better than season one of Last Airbender. But I would not say any of Korra's other seasons are better than season one of Last Airbender. Yo, let's go, it's a blissy! Finally! It looks so dumb. I was hoping you'd become a T-Tar at the same time. I wanted to, because I think you're still a Pupitar. Nice 5k. Do not like that face. <laughs> All right, you get the leftovers back. I have a lot of stuff to sell for money, I've just realized. And then you need the lucky egg. You don't like season one of Last Airbender? It's each their own, I guess. I mean, season one is the worst of the three seasons, but it's still incredible. Some great stuff in, uh, in season one of Last Airbender. Blistar! This thing is literally a blister. Yeah, that's right, you miss, idiot. Are you ground or rock? You're ground. Ooh, that means you're gonna be, um, if you do evolve into T-Tar, you're gonna be normal dark. Which is not as good for me as you being normal ground. So actually, don't evolve, please. What's with the level 6 Abra? Uh, teleport. Teleport works like fly in this game. The Abra is with me because I was teleporting between Celadon and Fuchsia. <coughs> Blast Terra is leveling up really fast. We won't, we won't have much longer of grinding to go. No! I should Earthquake, actually. No, because you're ground. You're not rock. So Aqua Tail does the most still, yeah. Bum, 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 ba, no, no. Mimicargo? I still can't believe that they made Mimikyu and Mikargo like literally just a trash bag with a, a tire tied to it. That's so funny. Oh man, that's so funny. Are you excited for Deadpool 3? Not excited. I mean, I'll probably go see it. I didn't think Deadpool 2 was as good as Deadpool 1. We never click synthesis. I think we might get Seed Bomb at some point for Torterra, or maybe we can move relearn Seed Bomb? I don't, we don't need grass coverage, though. We can already hit water, well, no, we can't really hit water types, but we can already hit, like, ground and rock types with Aqua Tail Stab. I think Crunch will be more useful for Psychic and Ghosts. Alright, we are almost done with this little level grind portion. Then we're gonna go hit up Sylphcal. Why bother with Synthesis when you have items? Because money, money. See how much money I've had to spend in this playthrough? Any amount of money I don't have to spend is a plus. All right, oh, iron defense, now we're talking. One more should do it. <laughs> 